all about the clap back. Get your boss whack, premieres funeral on Snapchat. Ha! You now tuned into the bad guy. That's my dating spin, low rider sitting low, hitting corners so hard you can taste my ribs. What's good, y'all? Fist Vegas, the hardest voice of sports. Go ahead, hit that like button and subscribe to the Fisk. You know why you at it. Y'all know what time it is. If you ain't with it, you best get with it. Now let's rock. Let's hit that sub button. All right, hit that sub button. Join this Fisk Unit Army and get Fisk Unit tough. Okay. You know who not Fisk Unit tough? Baker Mayfield. I'm not blaming Odell for this. I'm not blaming Odell for this. Because at the end of the day, Odell wants the damn ball. Odell deserves the damn ball. Now, granted, had he just shut the fuck up a couple years ago, he'd be on the team with the anointed one, Daniel Jones. He'd be getting all the deep balls he wants. But he, he couldn't shut the fuck up, so he's in Cleveland. So, indirectly, this is Odell fault. But for the sake of me not being petty and taking my Giants fan bias out of this, Baker Mayfield's trash. Now, Cleveland, yeah, Cleveland, I'm talking to you. I told you three years ago that y'all wasn't shit, was never going to be shit, and ain't never been shit. I told you if America was a face, y'all be the ugly pimple making us look bad. I've told y'all this. You didn't listen. I said you were Cleveland. You are a poverty franchise that would never prosper. But you didn't listen. You didn't listen. Oh, we're, we're going to sign all these players and we traded for Odell. It's a new day in Cleveland. We're going to be better. No, you're not. Because Baker Mayfield was never that guy. And this is documented. I have my archive channel up, 2,000 videos over there. During that 2018 draft, I specifically said, if he can't outrun fat donut eating cops, how he gonna outrun defenders in the NFL? The worst thing that happened to Baker Mayfield wasn't the fact that he got chased by a cop, it was the fact that he couldn't outrun a cop. All they do is sit in a cop car and eat donuts. He couldn't outrun them. He has bad judgment. He talked too much. He's cocky. He's not good. He's short. He's injury prone. You can't prosper with him at quarterback. I feel bad for Odell. This man's father put out an 11-minute video of Odell being butt naked down the field wide open. And, and Baker either not throwing it to him or not being able to get it to him. Baker got Odell injured on an interception return. Because Baker underthrew a ball. Odell Beckham hurt himself trying to chase the nigga down. At the end of the day, people, free OBJ. This is not OBJ being a problem. OG, OBJ hasn't said anything. He ain't do no Josina Anderson interviewing shit on the quarterback in the franchise like he did Elon Manning and the Giants. Put it that way, okay? He didn't do that, all right? He's not crying for the ball like he did in New York. He's actually been an upstanding citizen, which is why I feel like as a Giants fan, I am more than qualified to speak on Odell drama because I've been through it all. Cocaine and pizza in Paris, freaking Mary and kicking nets, helmet and Josh Norman, all boat trips, wearing Tims in Miami on boats. We've been through it all. But what I'm trying to explain to y'all is this. The Odell I know would be acting a fool right now. Eli Manning is a first battle Hall of Famer, two-time Super Bowl MVP quarterback. And he threw him all the way under the bus when he was in New York. He's yet to publicly do that to Baker. So as far as I'm concerned, Odell is an upstanding citizen right now. It ain't his fault the Browns didn't trade him. The Browns should have traded him. But the Browns, like I saw Saints fans, okay, who that nation? Those of y'all who saw didn't know what I was talking about. They didn't want to eat the salary. The Cleveland Browns did not trade Odell to the Saints because the Saints wanted Cleveland to eat that salary. Now, my beef with the Saints is y'all always find money to get players. Two years ago, you got Jack Rabbit from my Giants. You claimed off the waiver wire. I mean, y'all always find ways to get players. Now, y'all want to be cap conscious? 
There's a reason y'all were negative 90 something million uh, in the cap. Now all of a sudden the Saints want to be cap conscious. Now y'all want to be cheap. Ah, don't give me that shit. Saints fans talk about some Fisk. We can't afford OBJ. My black ass. If y'all wanted him, y'all would have fucking got him. All y'all do is spend money. That's why y'all was negative 90 in cap. Talk about something we can't afford it. No. The Saints are walking proof that teams afford what they want to afford. The LA Rams are walking proof that teams afford what they want to afford. This is why nobody traded for Odell because they knew this would happen. They knew that if he stayed in Cleveland, this whole situation will blow up. Now Odell's going to end up getting released or they're going to pay him to stay home like the Eagles did T.O. But at the end of the day, people, I can't blame Odell because Baker sucks. Cleveland sucks. You're not good. Joe Burrow and the Bengals are better. The Ravens are better. And the corpse of Ben Roethlisberger is better. Cleveland, you're no good. You had your chance. You lost to the backup quarterback in Kansas City. You couldn't even beat him. Baker can't throw balls unless he's play action in people. He has to be under center and call him play action. The minute you put him in a two-minute drive and shotgun, he can't do nothing but throw five-yard routes. It's a shame. This team is not, they're not special. Hate the, you know, I don't hate the break of the Cleveland fans. I actually take great pleasure. It's my pleasure to break this news to Cleveland that your Browns ain't shit. Your Cavs ain't shit. Your Indians ain't shit. Go back to the poverty city that you are, Cleveland. No championships for you. I hope you enjoyed 2016. Browns fans, I haven't forgot about how spicy you were talking to me a couple years back. Just because this is a new channel with new people don't mean I forgot. When I, on my original channel, y'all used to throw me under the bus. Y'all used to talk spicy. Oh, we're good. The Baker Mayfield this and Odell this and we got Kareem Hunt. Shut up. Look at you now. Look at y'all. You're pathetic. You don't want to pay Baker. You burn the bridge with Odell. Jarvis is nothing but a slot receiver. I mean, you're no good. Clowney sucks. Your secondary never panned out. And you still have not won a Super Bowl. Your window has closed. You couldn't win when Baker was cheap. Now you're going to have to pay Baker. For as trash as Baker is... Your sorry asses can't get better. You're going to pay them. It's, it's sad. But it's all good, though, because you're Cleveland. We need you to be you. We Cleveland, we need you to be this way so we can laugh and mock and make fun of you. You're you Cleveland. You were put here for our amusement. You really were. <laughs> you were put here for our amusement. So enjoy being the butt of all our jokes. But anyway, that's it. That's all. Subscribe to the unit if you rockin' with me. My name is Fist Vegas, and I approve this message.